Um, oh my god, it's day 60! Ah, wowie! Day 60. What can you do in 60 days? Um, that's two months, isn't it? Okay, the, the sheep are too territorial for me. I'm turning back. <laughs> I can't. I can't do this. Hello there. Hey, soul sister. Hey, you uh, um, I'm in the park on a lovely day. I haven't got much to say, to <laughs> uh, but last couple of days have been pretty good at work. Um, I finished a project I've been working on for about four months and it's completed to a pretty good standard and the regional director spotted me work and he gave me some praise uh, so I was really really happy with that and my manager wants to offer me a gradual role yeah! which I probably will not take but I will try and discuss an insurance offer but I'm really obviously happy with that as well that they like the shit I'm doing at work so yeah up the nationwide nationwide <laughs> hey girls so i and boys uh so i didn't want to do the work today so instead i'm organizing under my bed um i'm getting rid of all of my notes from three years of uni um because i won't be needing them anymore um and haven't used them in a while and yeah it's I'm making this room a home is my mission for today and it's going to be clean, organised, everything's going to be where I want it, everything's going to be where I know it is. Oh yeah. Today's source of amusement, um, I decided I'm going to set myself a little challenge. I'm, I'm doing the vlog! Oh, that was my mum. Anyway, I'm trying to see how long I can go without wearing my glasses and let me tell you, difficult. All you people with your blue light glasses. Oh, blue light glasses. Oh, you can just take them off. Just take them off. You have to wear them all the time. I am one specky bastard. Can't see for shit. Anything beyond my hand. No, no chance. Blurry. Mm -mm. Um, yeah, and it's really difficult. I lost the washing basket. My mum asked me to put the washing out. I couldn't find the bloody washing basket. Just couldn't see it. Couldn't see it. Lost it. Um, and I, I hear you, I hear you. Ooh, why do you put contact lenses in? I've seen you wear contact lenses. Yeah, there is that. But I only packed for a week when I came back here. Um, so consequently, I only packed about five pairs of contact lenses. So, yeah, that's why. Considering a sheep just ran at me, I'm going to assume I'm not welcome here. And I might just try and hop a barbed, barbed wire fence done it before I'll do it again <laughs> looks like other people have been trying to do the same oh he's staring at me that sheep what does he think I look like a twat you look like a twat you're covered in blue bitch <laughs> it's a good day I have got out of my hand out because yes. you're allowed to drive to me that's now if you haven't heard, and there's this place right by where we live called Kimba. Don't know if you've heard of it, and it's lovely. So, my brother's driven us, he's gone running because he's a psycho. A little straw because it's this really famous thing, so called the rock houses, which are houses built on rock, and you could go see them, they're like preserved. And I wanted to show you, but they're shut, which makes sense because of Corona. But I'll be walking past them so I'll show you. If you can see but there are the rock houses. They're like houses built into the rock. Makes sense. So it turns out the field that I was going to jump into is just filled with bigger animals. So I'm gonna stick with the sheep because they stare me out but they're not doing anything else. Because I think the thing in the other field is either a sheep, no, <laughs> what, a cow or a horse. But if I walk this way, I will be going to Anaswen. Okay, that sheep is staring, staring. But I can't get closer to the wall. Maybe I can. Over through here. <laughs> I'm 
bit, I'm shitting myself a little bit, but yeah. I don't want to get butted in the stomach by a sheep. Uh, it's lunch time. I'm really feeling uh, like a club sandwich. So I'm going to make a club sandwich. Stay tuned. Um, not much to say, just working today. Um, had a nice chilled morning with a coffee and a magazine, which was quite nice. I was feeling really shy this morning, actually. I feel a bit better now. Um, yeah, I finish on Wednesday. So, not too, too long to go. Yeah. Okay, this is the, um, sandwich. Wait, which way does this go? Station. Mm. Let's see if I can make one of these like wrap things that I saw on TikTok yesterday. So you put your filling in the wrap and then you fold it like that. You fold it like that again. So you've got your cheese in there. And then <laughs> you put it in your toaster. I just don't know if that's gonna work, but fingers crossed, I'll let you know. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. So every Friday, as a treat, <laughs> hello, um, I make banana pancakes. So that's what I'm gonna do. That's what I'm gonna show you how I do. Sometimes, um, if I'm having, if I'm feeling the chocolate vibe, I put a little bit of chocolate into a little bit of banana pancake. It's nice, it's good, yeah? I go get like this, yeah? Just in bed watching a movie. We had fish and chips tonight, which was nice. However, I've put on absolutely tons and tons of weight being at home not doing exercise it's probably my worst part about lockdown uh, and the trouble is i'm stress eating because of exams absolute nightmare but apart from that lockdown's sick that was the most intense stare off i've had with a sheep yet but yeah it was edging closer he was looking at me i was looking at it i was looking like and it was like, and I didn't even bring a jacket, I'm freezing. <laughs> Day 60, I resorted to a motherfucking ponytail to sort out my barnet. Um, because my hair is driving me fucking insane. Honestly, I can feel every motherfucking strand of hair coming out my fucking scalp and I'm done. I need it cut. I'm so done. It's so... I put conditioner in my hair this morning and I feel like my hair's just doubled in length. And I can just, just feel it on my head and I hate it. It's too long. It's so irritating. Fucking get off. I want to shave every, all my head. I'm so close to doing it. But I don't want to be, you know, like every other guy in the UK right now who's done that. But I'm fucking close to it, let me tell you. I'm fucking close to it. There's a cat hair in my salad dressing. Kitty. Right. Since you guys liked my banana review yesterday, I thought I'd just do one for this thing. Did It did get stuck in the toaster, I will say. Um... Yeah, it took a bit of effort to get it out again. It's quite squishy. I feel like the cheese has melted a bit inside. Let's let's, let's give it a go. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad at all. And also, because it's a tortilla, you're not getting all the mess. Well, you're getting some mess, but you're not getting all the mess. You get all the crunchy bits around the top. Oh, yeah, it's good. Give it maybe a seven out of ten. Ah, <laughs> just stepped in something prickly. Um, I'm in a field, as per usual. I was wondering if there were animals in here, and there are, but at least it's not the cows. But, um, yeah, it's just... 
kind of pretty. I went to go to Henry Waterfalls and I passed the entrance that's a footpath because I wasn't sure if it was the right one. So I kept going and thought, I'll just go the roadway. And then that was blocked off and there were farmers there and I was too scared to walk through the car park. So I'm kind of sad that I didn't get to go to the waterfalls on account of me being a pussy. But a walk is a walk. So my sister just went out to visit her dad and she brought me something back and that's something. First day of opening, you know my sister was going to be there. Mm. That's so good. That's so good. Oh my god. Bye.